Is it smelting fast or it's not smelting? It's furnace. I guess that's smelting. Yeah, that is smelting. Mine went faster. Um, who knows? Mine went stupidly fast, though. Um, yeah. I'm just... I need... No, I need... That sounds like a big me zombie. Part builder. Apparently, I got the achievement of having a furnace, <laughs> which I I want to get a second one going because I didn't want to stand here with all of this freaking yeah grout waiting and. I was going to say, no, we have more string. That's convenient. Exactly three. That's what I needed. Uh, well, I had four more. No, I mean, that's, what I would, that's what I needed at the time, so. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Second stack of grout is now going. Yay! Oh. No, it's up here. How's your food situation? Um, good. Okay. Okay, there's that. We should take that and that. Uh, we got the winter squash. Okay. Um, we haven't cooked the calamari yet. That's okay. Just leave that stuff there for now. Just is... Oh. Actually, a little bit slower, but the durability is hilarious. So... Oh, that's good. Okay, the difference between my wooden my wooden short bow and my slime short bow. Um, mm -hmm. The wooden short bow does... Well, okay, the draw speed is one second and the arrow speed is one times. That's with, you know, no modifiers. Right. So the durability max is 384 with no modifiers. Huh. Um, my slime short bow, the draw speed is 1.2 seconds, so very slightly slower, but the arrow, arrow speed is 1.2 times, so very slow, a, a, about it as exactly as much faster, basically. Mm -hmm. um, but the durability is 1536. <laughs> so it's got like what? Five, five times the durability almost <laughs> yeah. for you know, slightly slower draw speed, but faster shooting or faster uh, arrow speed. Um, mm -hmm. my, actually, my normal short bow is almost full on durability, so I'll put that in the miscellaneous chest. So that you have a bow if you want one. If you haven't already made one. Yeah, yeah I haven't made one yet. Yep, so you have one in the chest. And there should be three arrow, three regular arrows in there, so if you just keep those in your inventory and put, uh, make some arrows and put them on your... Quick um, bar. bar right next to it, it's more likely to use those instead of the normal arrows. Every now and then it will be annoying and use the ones you don't want it to use, but... I will have to look into that. <sighs> but not at the moment, because... <laughs> brain not functioning. Brain not work. Yeah. There's just so much going on. Oh, let's take these melon seeds. I got a few melons. We'll throw those. Uh, and do we have any more feathers hanging around anywhere? Oh, we no. also apparently have nine more regular arrows in the other miscellaneous chest. Yeah. We should actually probably set up and start some manner of chicken farm. Once we get the smeltery going, I can build a better chicken farm. Just because I'll have the iron to build a hopper. We should probably sleep so that it goes to day. Yeah, that would be good. I'm surprised it's letting us because I hear a pygmy out there. Yeah, I was hearing something. Oh! Maybe it's on the roof. I don't know. Don't see it. I'm you going for sand. Oh, I gotta oh, there go. it is. It's chasing me down. Oh, uh, you need help? Are you okay? No, I got it. 
It was riding a chicken. Uh, now I have some feathers. <laughs> a couple feathers. I need more than that, but... I can... Still throw stuff in here. Um... Well, I can... Okay, I want shovel. That's what I'm after. Actually, well, I have the stuff. Let me... Ah! Part builder. Um... Is there a good up. spot over here? I can get some more calamari, maybe. Hmm. And we have carrots, so we can get a pig farm going as well, which is not a bad thing. Cool. Yeah. Yep. Always helpful. Ooh, found more clay. Oh, and gravel in the exact spot of the clay. Cool. I like that. Alright, I need... Uh. Come on. Oh, yeah. Uh. Oh. Yeah. Well, if you're just going to swim right up to me, Squiddy, I'm going to get some calamari. <laughs> okay. Comparatively. Slime weighs less than wood. Uh, what's the damage difference? Bone weighs less than flint, but flint does more damage. Accuracy is still the same. So yeah, let's go with that. Figuring out arrows and stuff? Yep. Ooh, that was close. Almost suffocated. Oh, fun. Well, Probably can't do that. Well, st almost started to drown, I should say. Ah. Oh. That time I was taking damage. Just totally was not paying attention. Ah. <sighs> Gravel, I have close to a stack. There's a good deposit here. Well, I noticed we were running low. Okay, that's a rerun. Let's get the sand. I'm not concerned about. Okay. Um. Is there a tornado? No, it doesn't look like it. Okay. I just hear rain. So we can get those and add them to the other pile. Oh, and mm, what do we got here? Let's take a look and I'll sand. Oh, some gravel across the way. Yep. Okay. They are better and I'll be making more when they can. I just need to find... we ought to have chickens hanging around somewhere. I just need more, uh... feathers. I guess I could have taken the lazy mobile, but I really don't care. <laughs> nice name for it, lazy mobile. Mm -hmm. I love it. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, if you decide you want to go on a gathering run somewhere, feel free to take that thing. Um, I'll you, just... I don't know uh, what your control setup is for Archimedes ships, but for the most part, you know, moving, like, horizontal movement is the same as 
walking. Um, vertical movement depends on what your keys are set to. Uh, well, I don't uh, remember what it defaults to, but I have my up and down set to R and F. Just it's convenient. I see. I see. Uh, I think uh, it defaults to like Q and E probably. I'll have to take a look. But yeah. So we got clay down here. No, but a lot of squid. All right. Well, let me put this stuff. In. My Here. shovel broke, but I'm harvesting some squid. Mm -hmm. Actually, let me get this stuff out and put. Uh, there we go. That that looks like a. Big deposit of clay. Ooh, found a good spot. Does happen. Okay. Okay. Well, hey, you found redstone apparently. Yeah, just a couple pieces. <clears throat> that was in the hut where you found what I had to drop off. Oh, with the diamonds, I guess. Yep. So we have a couple diamonds that'll be good as um for something. I don't know. Yeah, we're not well if I can find an ocean biome, we probably won't need any for a, a enchanting table. <laughs> Just because I'll be able to find one. Um hmm. I'm trying to think what else we usually do diamonds for. I mean there's you know, armor, armor. and picks, but picks you could actually work around and just modify with a diamond instead of making them with a diamond. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter since most things only take one. And diamonds, I'm pretty sure, just function like anything. They're not metal, so I think you just use them in the um. Hell, let me find out. <laughs> ah. Well, okay. Whoa. Um, what? Okay. I was moving sticks at the time, and they were there a second ago, but, um... Okay, uh... uh sand grab... I want to do this. I could make... I'm not sure what the durability bonus is for a full diamond pick, but we would need one more diamond to find out. <laughs> yeah. Um... See whether it's... I mean, I know their durability is pretty ridiculous. All right. Two stacks of seared brick made, and two more stacks cooking off right. now. Oh, cool. Um, I put them in the chest. Okay, I will just grab them to make into things. Um, me grab this extra crafting table because it'll be easier to have it down there while I think of exactly what I need. Mm. All right, so. I don't think... No, we won't need any more regular... Well, no, we'll need one more regular block just to go above the input drain. Right. Everything else, at least for now, while I get this thing functional, is going to be... Um... Drains. <laughs> ah, I see. Um... Just a matter of how I want to set them up. I think I usually Yeah, okay, so I'll just make nine grains, which I should have enough for. I have more than enough for that. Um Okay, so we would Probably be good and uh, digging. Putting some oh. points into digging would be a good idea. Yeah, I mean, I have a few points into digging. Actually, no, it doesn't help me out for whatever I'm doing. It doesn't speed anything up or whatever. Oh. Well, I'm going after clay, and if there was a chance to get a little bit more clay and stuff like that, but there isn't. Just, you have a chance to get other loot. Yeah. Alright, there's nine drains. 
Which... Shit, it's getting Good. to be night. I don't want it to be night. Yeah. Oh, I feel cold breeze. Uh, okay, I'm headed home. Wait, now I need... Okay. Those and one set of those, which inexplicably craft in fours, and I've never had a use for more than like one. <sighs> Naturally. Yeah, the faucets, which you know I need tons of, craft individually. Yes. The casting channels, which I use generally at most one, uh, cast in fours. You're like they craft in fours, so. Good job, guys. It's like, really? And that's like the opposite of what I need. Uh, yes, quite. Oh, quite. I need another faucet, actually. Okay, so what are we doing? Uh, we need sand. We need gravel. And I actually... Well, oh, wait, I'm going to need... What about this? I'm trying to think. That's the main thing, sand and gravel. So Although... Here... The fact that you are getting uh, two more stacks. What? Well, huh? the fact that you're getting two more stacks may be enough, at least for now. Oh, yeah. It'll be enough for now. Okay, I need... Um, ah! <laughs> Sorry. Do we have... Oh, good. I was going to say, do we have a spare sand? That's really all I needed was one. Yep. Right yep. Now. We're all good. Um, uh, I'm trying to see the input point. Oh, where the hell's the input point? What do you mean? Uh, where you put the ores? Oh, there it is. You right-click the controller. Yeah. Melting some glass. <laughs> so, yeah, like, I'm showing okay, the people. So it's like, that. here's our fuel right. base. Here's what's being cooked off, and I want the other one. There we go for now. You can just fill this up. You can yep. only put one block in each square. That's why if you make it really big, you can put the yep. full stack in. Every layer is exactly as big as it is, which is I right, put put that. Um, three by three. Yep. So every layer of block so it has to be a fully sealed off layer before you actually can do anything with it yeah um and look at that the block is actually block inside in there don't fall in um i one, i could get out right now because i have a long sword and could long jump out uh, you couldn't because you don't use log sword i think you have broad sword or something yes well the other thing too which is kind of cool um sand is Taking well, they found yeah. out in uh, on the on the other server. Oh, and different materials smelt at different rates in this thing. So yeah, is some take forever. Some are exceedingly fast. You fall in there when you have melted whatever, and you take damage, and your blood stays in there. Yep, which you use to make pig iron. Not can, too... I mean, it can be your blood, or you can toss a mob in there. Whatever. And you know. actually, if they generally, if they drop any items, it will show up in the blocks of the controller of the smeltery if there's room. That's so you can cool. get their items back. If it's something that will smelt, though, like if you have an enderman in there and it drops an ender eye, because those will smelt, um, you can get liquid ender out of that, but, um, but if you and don't want you that, actually oops. get liquid and yeah, so you need to get to it quickly if if you don't want that. Yeah. And it's not only when you smelt uh, sand in the smeltery, you get clear glass. 
As opposed to glass. As opposed to regular glass, yeah. There are no lines or anything on it. It's clear. Which it is... can also be used to make seared tanks, which is what I wanted. <laughs> oh, I see, I see. Um... Seems like what would be nice if you're going to have a nice big thing is to have many of these tanks. Okay. Yeah. Um, well, for the lava, I mean. Yeah, like I said, I usually try to make like four tanks at least just for to have backup lava. Mm -hmm. um, and I have a spare tank now. I just needed something to put the faucet on and I figured I may as well make a tank to do it. Um, so we have right now a spare... Of the stuff I grabbed, those two things. We finished that, so we have a double layer, a simple double layer smeltery. And, nice. let's see, that and that and that. Uh, oh, and that and that. Um, but yeah, we have one extra brick and three casting channels that will probably never get used, but... <laughs> yeah. I, I suppose in higher layers I could probably make uh, other inputs... Because the, the thing with the input is that things only go in one ingot at a time. <laughs> yeah. Well, um... Now, keep in mind, if you're trying to, like, drain a full tank into that, <laughs> oh, it's boy. a lot. And I don't think it actually divides evenly. Or I know it, it might. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, it, it's, it's, yeah. For the casting channels, can you actually connect them and have uh -huh. it flow along a path just you for fun? Can, but it's unreliable. I think uh, I, I get the impression there might be some loss over time due to it. So darn! Like the further you have them go, the more of the liquid will like just get kind of stuck in the channel because it doesn't have the flow to flow anymore. Um, and I've had that where you get some really funky amounts of things. Like, yeah. not even enough to make a nugget, so you end up with metal stuck in there because it's too little to use. That and basically, the, the only useful thing you can do at that point is either add more until you eventually balance it out. Uh -huh. Or drain it into, like, a casting basin, break the casting basin, and then anything that was in the basin will be lost. The tanks... And seared windows, for some reason, that act as tanks. Um, they're just more clear. Um, those will keep whatever's in them. Like, a, a casting basin or a casting table won't. Interesting. If you break them, so. I mean, if it's like a solid item already, it will fall out, I think. But, what are you doing? Oh, I'm getting XP. Ah. Whoa, okay, that was a surprise. Yeah. <laughs> okay, then. <laughs> All right. Moving along. Grab that stack. Grab this stack. Oh, they're all done. That is good. That is yep. good. Now. Yeah, I think I'll put five. No. Yeah, five into mining. Yep. That'll be good. I'm trying to do it in fives. Wow. Wow. Uh, I'm waiting for daytime. Come on, daytime. That's a twelve. Yeah, I thought it would have been cool to use like a channel thing to just have it flow for the sake of aesthetics. It it would be a neat idea, but I'm pretty sure there's loss involved, and it just kind of, eh. That's, that. that's disappointing. It really is. Yep. Zombie dead. Yay. Or, sorry, skeleton. <laughs> okay, so we're going out for clay and sand and gravel. Clay is less immediately important unless you just want, you know, bricks or hardened, well, hardened clay actually looks pretty neat, but, um... Well, it's more of 
there seems to be a pretty big deposit here, so... Yeah, I mean, if you just want to harvest it, go for it. But now we have yeah. a, um... I just doubled the height of our smeltery. So now it can hold, uh... A lot. <laughs> Thir 36, I think. So we almost have a full Copper, stack. Iron, iron, okay, so... Let me see. I put... We had, what, 23 iron ore and 8 iron gravel ore... And I have five spots left. Wow. Nice. Alright, now, so I'm gonna do that. I actually need, I'm trying to think, it's aluminum and tin, I think. It was, like, it was either, no, it was aluminum and copper, wasn't it? For aluminum For, brass? Yeah, copper. Okay. So I'll, I've got three aluminum gravel and a copper gravel in there now so that that can do its thing. Oh, excellent. Oh, once space frees up, I can. I mean, I'm trying to think, how much iron did I put in there? Most of that can be probably, so one, two, I guess I've got, what, three, no, six blocks of iron plus I'm an ingot short of another block of iron. Oh, darn. But. That's okay. Not ultimately super concerned. The smeltery does look cool. Yep. It's very handy. Because <laughs> once I... Actually, I know what I need to do. Well, that all is kind of doing its thing. Uh, right. I think it's... I really hope it's iron and tin for bra uh, bronze. Where did I put the books? Um, by yeah. the door. Alloys are only a couple pages in. Bronze. Oh, copper and tin. Okay, good. Iron. Yeah, we didn't have too much copper. Aluminum brass is aluminum and copper. Good. No, we didn't, but that's fine. I just needed to... Double check that. Oh, yeah. There's some. Um... So, how much did I get out of that? Let's take a quick peek. That's all I need for that. Whoa. Short trip out so far, and I am up to over three stacks of clay. Nice. It's... Yeah, clay accumulates fast because you get it in fours. And well, it's just in this one area, one little pond area. It's just a gold mine for that. Yep, that happens. So I have, right now, I have, what, eight ingots of aluminum brass. Mm-hmm. And 62 ingots of iron. Oh, that's awesome. Because I put in 31 blocks, basically. I put in 31 uh, ore. Yeah. So, now I need... Let me see, actually, I've got... I just need wood. Chest behind the bed has some wood. Yep, I see that. I just need to make sure I have enough to do what I need. So, let's do that. Okay, getting some sand, and there goes the shovel. Fun. You know what? Wow, I found another nice deposit of clay. Mm -hmm. So, heading home. Okay. Yep, right now I am making basically wooden everything um, so that I have something to make the metal patterns out of. Right, yes. And I just need to... So wood will work here? Uh -huh. Because, well, I, the wood works here for making the patterns. 
Um, well, the wood works basically to pour the aluminum brass over to make the... Yeah, no, just the server... The blank. The server...